Hello, and welcome back to Big G's Railroad Channel. I'm Big G, your host, and today I am bringing you a content challenge. This is for all of our creators on YouTube. Not only is that going to help the content creator, but it's also going to help the viewers as well because the viewers are going to be able to have new content on everybody's channel that takes care of this challenge. The challenge is three different layouts in three different scales. Now, as you'll see at the end of this video, one of the ones that I did, <laughs> not model railroads, it's still a railroad, but it's not model railroads. Now, I did this challenge in about 12 and a half hours is what it took me to take and get mine knocked out. Um, some of you may take longer. Some of you may be able to do it a lot quicker. One of the rules of this challenge is you cannot use your own layout or layouts. This is meant for you to get out into the world, meet and greet some of your viewers or some people that maybe you just met, and take and create some of their, or showcase their layouts. Another thing you can't do, don't go to a train museum that has three different layouts. I mean, you can, but is that really what I'm looking for? No. I'm looking for you to expand your creativity, your content, and showcase stuff that maybe not everyone gets to see all the time. One of the videos that I did in here was actually an open house that's never been filmed. The guy that invited me back in September to his open house that he had just a couple weeks ago, I partook of that, and with that, I actually got to meet Dave with the Cricket River in Eastern. Got to do a layout tour of his, and that was two of the challenge, uh, or two of the pieces that is in this challenge, and you will see at the end of the video when I do my highlight reel. What this challenge should do is it should create four videos, at least four videos for you. One from each one of the three different scales and layouts that you go to. The fourth one should be a highlight reel. And what that is is it's just basically snippets of each one of the three layouts or the three tours that you do. Now... When you're doing this, it could cause you to create other videos. And that's what I'm going to talk about a little bit right now. As you can see above me is my roller coaster picture wall. In previous videos, I've talked about my pictures um, from my own ride photos from some of my favorite roller coasters that I've ridden around the world. So, or around the country, not the world. Big G's not that big yet. Anyways. In this challenge, I went and it was it allowed me the opportunity to go to the grand opening of a new roller coaster and the to be there on opening weekend. Now, this roller coaster it's near and dear to me. Uh, I rode it 15 minutes before they had a terrible accident back when it was top thrill dragster. Rode it 15 minutes before it closed permanently. And then another roller coaster company come in, took over, modified it, and when they modified it, they took and built a big 400-foot spike that you have to go up backwards. It is now Top Thrill 2, and that is Big G in the front row. Let me get that a little closer. Can't really see my face, but man, I was having a blast. 120 miles an hour, 420 feet up in the air in one direction. In reverse, you go 400 foot straight up a spike and straight back down at 100 miles an hour. Absolutely amazing. If you love speed, you love adrenaline, that's the one to go do. They are having some issues with it. It's shut down right now, but they are working to get that back online. If you have the opportunity to go ride it, 
please do yourself a favor. If you like that kind of stuff, and go do it. It's worth it. Oh, yeah. I'm going back as soon as they get it fixed. Well, not as soon, but I am planning on going back a couple times this summer. <clears throat> you know, like, Big G, you're nuts. Yeah, it's nine hours away, but it's worth every moment in that car to go ride that. As I use some of my new tools, there's a train. Look, I don't have any hands. There's nobody in the uh, room with me, and this camera is moving around. See, this was another piece of technology that I'm adding to my channel. Now, why am I adding it to my channel? It's because I can do stuff like this. I can now move around my layout and bring you guys, the viewers, with me around my layout. I can go over here and I can talk and the camera is going to follow me wherever I go. It's got a little tracking system on it. It's up on a stand right now that's a little taller than I am. And I can go literally anywhere I want in my layout room. And you get to see stuff that you normally don't see, like Fat Man Squeeze right here, or Big G Squeeze. Yeah, uh-huh. I got to do a little dance maneuver just to get around my layout. Mm-hmm. So, like I said, three different layouts, three different scales. That's what I want you to go out and create. It should create four videos for your channel. It should bring you in some new subscribers. It should also bring you in some new views. Um, watched hours, if you're trying to get those, you know, subscribers, whatever the case may be, this is the challenge to help you, the creator, out. Now, when you get that highlight reel, get the highlight film done, what I want you to do is I want you to go into the comments in this video Put them down below so that I, Big G, can go in and watch your challenge video. I want to see three different scales, three different layouts, three different locations possibly, because this is a challenge. I don't want it to be easy. It wouldn't be a challenge if it was easy. It cannot be your layout. I know I'm repeating these rules over and over. It's to stress how important this is. <clears throat> Why am I doing this? Why am I challenging you guys to do this? Simple. Growth. Growth for our community within YouTube. Growth as a channel creator. And growth in your own channel. Yeah, Big G cares about your channel. I've seen growth out of mine already. I literally, I put out one video from one of the layout tours that I did, and I got 20 subscribers off of it. 20! I'm not seeing that much growth in a little while. It's awesome. Maybe you, and it's only been out like six days. Six days, and I've seen a 20 subscriber growth from one video. This is the video challenge to get you motivated to bring you and the community closer because you're going to go out and you're going to see videos being posted, hopefully of some layouts that we've not seen here on YouTube. Bring the viewers what we want. Yes, I said we. I am a viewer too. I want to see layouts in your area that I've not seen before. I want to see ideas I've not seen before. My bridge scene over there, still not done. I have something ticking around up in here that's going to be fun. Not seen it done on a video before. Not seen it done on a layout. It may be out there, but I've not seen it. Something I've had in mind for a while. Anyways, I'm going to show you my highlight reel. I want you to be able to create four new videos for your channel that will not include your own layout, your own creations. Do not go to a train show. Do not go to a train museum. Literally, take this challenge serious and get out there and experience three different layouts in three different locations. It would be amazing. Thank you for watching. And this is my highlight reel. By the way, this is part of my first of the three-part challenge I was telling you about earlier today. 
Um, Dave gave me a wake up call this morning, told me to be over here around eight o'clock. So as you can see, I made it. Um, coffee time. Yeah, coffee time. <laughs> Widgets, I guess. I don't know. You know. <laughs> uh, named this little truck repair shop after my father. It's Frank's truck repair. He was a truck driver his whole life, 50 years or so. Of that when you first walk in the room, you see what I consider to be my signature scene so far. My bridge scene over the Crooked River. And so, it is absolutely gorgeous. Coming across the bridge there. <laughs> and as you can tell with an HO layout, Dave has really done good with the length of trains. Absolutely loving this train going by. Nice. Yeah, here's the rest of it here. This train is yeah. about 50, 50 cars. Long so, when I add the rest of it in. So an HO layout in a basement, 50 cars long. Pretty awesome. So there's the head of it and there's the tail of it and Dave's yeah. in the middle of it. <laughs> That's pretty much exactly I'm already. <laughs> let, let him go. Okay. Go ahead, yeah, that's good. If you want to, go ahead. You're good. Oh, were you filming right there? That's good. You're oh. good. <laughs> <laughs> You're good. Well, that would have been a sweet shot. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting. Well, I'm. I'm still filming it. I may. I may put that one, which that's sitting. Thank you. 